Welcome to 13 Hour Time 62 Lego Set Reviews. Of the Surfer. This is from the Collectible Minifigure Series 2. Um, this was released in 2010. This minifigure has six pieces and retailed at the time for $2. This minifigure will change in price um, depending on the buyer, depending on who's selling them on eBay. Sometimes it goes for. I don't know. I mean, a lot of the figures in this series will go for different prices. Um, this one particularly can go for $13, but it's a better value if you get him in the minifigure accessory set, which I did. But I'm going to work backwards and put him back into the minifigures uh, series too. This particular bag has been used with another minifigure, and that's why... Um, is it will not ha I will not be showing you the dot codes associated with it. You can see the Surfer is one of the nine figures shown on the front. And there's the back. I do have the top trimmed off, so sorry about that. I didn't know much at the time as far as the methods for the uh, Series 2. I've, I've improved since then, though. The Surfer is number 15 of 16 figures, and here are some of the other ones in the series. It was, a, it was an okay collection. Had a lot of unique pieces. Some of these minifigures have been reproduced in other minifigure accessory sets, just like the one that we have today. And here we have the different kinds of gear that go onto a minifigure. I have the surfboard from our server down here. So let's get on to our minifigure. I'll just put him on this little stand that I have made for him. We'll first take a look at our minifigure himself. As you can see, he's got pretty much all new printing at the time of the minifigure. And what you notice probably right away is his shorts. Um, that's something that at the time was pretty new for minifigures to have bathing suit shorts with well, actually printed on yellow bricks. You see that on the back. So from both sides you don't get the blue, you only get it from the legs on the front and sides. He does have a nice torso because it's just a regular basic um, guy torso I guess. He's got blonde hair, which is very similar to some of uh, the minifigures, like the skater from Series 1. Uh, you've also seen this for the birthday figure in the birthday accessory set. Um, and a lot of other minifigures can have this hairstyle as well. This is one of the few times that it's been made in blonde. And here's a look at his face. It's a very unique face where you get some... He's got a little smirk on him. But he also seems kind of calm. He has a little bit with cheekbones showing. And he also needs a shave. The skateboard, um, the surfboard, not skateboard, is the piece that you get in this set along with him. And this can fit on his hands in both directions. You can have it fit on both sides. Facing this way and this way. Is actually a pretty unique surfboard piece. We also have some studs that go underneath it. So if you want to use it or hold it up on a rack, um, you can do that. You can also fit the minifigure right on top because there are two studs to fit the figure. And then you can just turn his head and have him ride some waves. Just like that. I didn't think I would be... Um, I didn't think I would like this figure too much, but from Series 2, I think he's one of my favorites, not just because he's a reproduced version, but also because he's got some nice detail that's kind of uh, cool to use in a bunch of other LEGO scenes um, in a lot of different areas. You could use it in a lot of different kinds of themes depending on what you're looking into. Now, if you just hold on a sec, <clears throat> I'm going to our minifigure character encyclopedia. And we are looking up the minifigure facts for the surfer. It says the mini facts. Likes bodacious waves. Dislikes the winter. See also the lifeguard and surfer girl. Surfer girl will be coming soon in a Lego review.
first ever printed LEGO surfboard. And I can prove that to be true because in the past, it's alright, in the past there have been stickers that are usually added onto surfboards. So this one comes in the set printed. See also the minifigure accessory set review for um, additional information about where you can find this figure even nowadays. Thanks for watching this review and we'll see you next time.